Hello everyone, welcome back. Today, we are exploring Amazon CloudFront with common interview questions. Whether you are new or experienced, let's sharpen those skills. Let's dive in. The first question is, What is CloudFront? The answer is, Amazon CloudFront is a content delivery network offered by Amazon Web Services. It is designed to improve the performance, scalability, and availability of web content and applications by delivering them to users with low latency and high data transfer speeds. CloudFront helps to distribute content across a global network of edge locations strategically located around the world. The next question is, what is geo-restriction in CloudFront? The answer is, Geo-restriction feature in Amazon CloudFront allows you to restrict access to your content based on the geographical location of the users. With geo-restriction, you can choose to allow or deny access to your content from specific countries or regions. The next question is, How to deliver content faster? The answer is, by utilizing content delivery network like Amazon CloudFront or other similar services. CDNs cache your content in multiple edge locations distributed across the globe. When users request content, it is delivered from the nearest edge location, reducing latency and improving response times. The next question is, What are the uses of AWS CloudFront? The answer is, AWS CloudFront is a content delivery network that accelerates the delivery of web content to end-users globally. It can be used for improving website performance, streaming video content, distributing software and application updates, delivering live and on-demand media streaming, and enhancing security with DDoS protection. CloudFront catches content at edge locations for reducing latency and improving the user experience. The next question is, Is digital rights management inbuilt as part of CloudFront? The answer is, No. Digital rights management is not built directly into Amazon CloudFront. CloudFront itself is primarily a content delivery network that focuses on efficient and fast delivery of content to end users. By combining the DRM capabilities with CloudFront, you can provide secure and protected content to your users while ensuring efficient delivery and low latency. The next question is, when to use Amazon CloudFront? The answer is, Amazon CloudFront is like a super-fast delivery service for web content. It stores copies of your website's data in many different places around the world, so when someone visits your site, they get the data from the closest location to them. If your users are spread out all over the world and you want your site to load quickly for everyone, CloudFront is a great choice. It makes sure your content gets to your users as fast as possible, no matter where they are. The next question is, How to disable cache for CloudFront? The answer is, For disable caching, change the following caching settings. Minimum TTL, 0 seconds. Maximum TTL, 0 seconds. Default TTL, 0 seconds. The next question is, Can I use CloudFront for dynamic content? The answer is, Yes, you can use Amazon CloudFront for dynamic content delivery. While CloudFront is commonly known for accelerating the delivery of static content. To support dynamic content delivery, you can configure caching rules based on query strings, cookies, or headers to determine which dynamic content should be cached and for how long. The next question is, Can a single web server be used to implement CDN at Amazon? The answer is, Yes, it is possible to implement a basic content delivery network using a single web server on Amazon Web Services. However, 
It is important to note that this approach may not provide the same level of performance and scalability as a dedicated CDN service like Amazon CloudFront. The last question is, what are CloudFront invalidations? The answer is, CloudFront invalidations allow you to remove an object from the cache before its TTL expires. This is useful when you need to update or remove content immediately. However, invalidations are subject to charges and may take some time to propagate across all edge locations. Thanks for going through the Amazon CloudFront interview questions and answers with us. Your time and engagement mean a lot. If you found this helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing and stay tuned for more content. We appreciate your support.